Hello, hope you are doing well. So I am going to show how to you can use this data edit rule. Okay. If your macro is not enabled, then you need to macro enable in. So my macro is enabled. So there is our credential is opening and you need to provide user password. So I am going to input some sample the end password there is admin and password is one two three you can change it anytime so click to login okay there is our required data entry form if i explain this there is our drop down list and also the there is our checkbox and is date format and you can see lead time and date there is two date suggest and you can edit this from using calendar button anytime and also this here is calendar button okay PMD objection also the drop down list you can all our drop down list you can customize anytime uh, then the hour is impact cost so that is old and new so if you click to old then internal and external will be open or also the new okay then the comments and stakeholder review there is also the affected which is yes no options name you required name input and the next is also yes no aligned when you click this date field then uh, the calendar field will be automatically open open for selection so i am selecting this then the comment okay after all that are imported uh, you can see there are add new update delete and clear button so you need to if you want to add new something then of course you need to click add new do you want to save data yes and data will be stored in your database and also the summary is showing in our list box okay you can see if you want to update anything like double click here and click to or change anything then i need to change there i need to change anything there okay okay now click to update button again yes okay the data will be updated and also a delete if you want to delete anything like double click here and delete button okay data will be deleted and all our imported field you can clear by using clear button okay next is search options search option like you need to search anything like assign change initiator lead time for example you need to search between lead time then click lead time and start date in date so i need to first june to first june then click search and data will be open and the, the one data will be accounted one data counted will be show the below option is download repression open all records and exit there you can uh, there is our required data will be show and you can download as a excel format or pdf format if i want to download as a excel format like in like uh, excel select and then download okay or refresh you can also again download so uh, no need to show i'm going to i want to show this type okay our required data will be downloaded okay next is pdf pdf there is also the required minimal field will be selected and pdf format it will be download like okay pdf will be downloaded okay the next option is open all records this is also for you can see the data entry sheet also the customizable for your drop down list so need to open all records and there is our data entry sheet which is imported all data in this here 
so another sheet is support sheet there you can change credential and also the drop down list these are drop down list if you change anything from here this will be affected in our user form so uh, for example i am changing this there effectively and i am going to open uh, launch open launch form again so using refresh and effectively added another is test okay the last option is exit if you want to close this or leave this form then you use exit do you want to leave okay yes the form will be closed that's all thank you so much